What's up guys, welcome back to Watch Dogs 2. We're going to be finishing the series off here, collecting all the key data points. Starting off with the one that's in the Stanford University area. So if we take a look at the map, here is Stanford University. I am standing right here outside this fountain, and the key data point is kind of across the street in this giant tower. So we're going to head over to this tower. <clears throat> Scattered it out a little bit before we went in, so I'm not going to be running in blind. But if you stay over to the right side, you can kind of climb up these flower planters or these whatever they are, concrete um, flower beds. And then you want to run towards the back side of the building when you're on this level here. And you'll see somewhat of like a little staircase with these generators or air conditioning units, whatever they are. Once you get up here, there's a little vent on the ground so you know what it's time for. Time to pull out the jumper. So we're going to access the jumper unlock that door and here we go so it looks like the key data is straight ahead we're gonna have to find our way through this maze of vents and so we've got our first dead end now we're gonna go this way uh, and there we go that's it oh no that's not it we've got a little bit of a puzzle to complete here I thought it was too simple Alright, so let's select this. It's kind of hard to see. Oh, we're back outside. So let's uh, get back into Marcus here. And we're going to try to complete this puzzle. Um, actually, it's probably going to be a little bit easier if we use the quadcopter. We can easily go around to all these nodes and unlock them. So this is, wow, this is a fairly large puzzle that we need to complete here. <laughs> So let's go around, let's take a look. So we got all these going way up to the top here. Something tells me we're gonna have some, uh, oh, we're out of, we're out of, sig or out of, uh, what is it saying? <laughs> I'm out of range, that's what I'm trying to say. Can I get a little bit higher losing signal? Still can't unlock that. Oh, we're too high, we're too high, go back down. Alright, so let's take a look over in this direction. So, what do we have? Do we have anything we can unlock? Well, we can turn this one. And that doesn't really help us at the moment. What else do we have here? What is this? This fan is probably going to be in the way. So, let's tell it to drive forward, get out of the way. Wow, this is a pretty complicated one. Let's go over this way. So we were able to unlock that node by getting the van off of the uh, pad there. And from here on, you just want to continue unlocking these nodes. So that's that one. Now we go over here, unlock that, and let's try to head back to the top here. We should be able to unlock this one. If I can just get into range. There we go. Let's lower it down a little bit. Probably gonna have to do the same thing over on the uh, left side of this building. So let's lower ourselves back down, move this van backwards or forwards, whichever, <laughs> whichever one I end up picking by accident, and we'll just switch around some of these nodes. So we'll come over in this direction, swip, switch everything around so that we can unlock the nodes we need, continue unlocking them just following the path around. And we're probably going to have to climb back up here and see if there's some more nodes to unlock. So let's lower ourselves down a little bit. Alright, what do we have? One more on this side of the tower. I'll call this a bell tower probably. Unlock that. Let's go around to the back side here. Unlock that. Now we should be able to unlock this one. We'll rotate this. Don't want to go up, I want to go down. Oh, look at that, we've got a door right here. So that door is now unlocked. Should be able to jump back into being Marcus. And we should be able to get in there no problem. So if we continue around this building, climb over this other air conditioning vent, or air conditioning system, climb up this wall, open this door, and we should have it right there on the ground. 
So, why can't I pick it up? There we go. Stanford University key data. That one was a little tricky, but we were able to get it completed. And we're in our second location for today's video, which is Kirby Cove. I believe that's what it's called. Kirby Cove. What is it called? Yes, Kirby Cove. So, here's Kirby Cove on the map. As you can see, it's on the northern side of the Golden Gate Bridge. And the key data is right down here in this restricted area location. Kind of in like a, I don't know, looks like an old abandoned bunker or park or something. So we're going to climb up inside here. As you can see, again, like I said, it is in a restricted location. Looks like it's the Sons of Ragnarok. They've got the guard dogs right here. This guy's coming out. So we're going to pull our gun on him. Got to take these dogs out before they get us. One more. Got a couple more guards. A couple more Sons of Rag Ragnarok gang members. I think there's one more behind here. Coming around. And we're going to take this guy out. So that's all of them. And right here on the ground, there's the key data. Kirby Cove key data. That is all you guys need to do to pick this one up. I'm going to pick this gun up though. Alright guys, we're headed to our final location to pick up the last key data point. And as you can see, we are on a boat. And that's because you need to head to Alcatraz Island. So I'm going to pop the Noodle Maps icon open up here. So as you can see, we're in the middle of the water here. And here's Alcatraz. Now, not sure exactly where on the island we need to get to, but I do know the last key data point is on Alcatraz Island. Again, <clears throat> if you select the uh, research points, uh, and the ones that do require a key data point, you can uh, pull the map open, or you can you have the option to look them up on the map to see where they are. And again, like I said, this one, I know this last one is somewhere on this island. So let's pop off of this boat. If we can get off the boat, go for a little swim. Usually you're not trying to break into Alcatraz, but that's what we're doing here. Yeah. Gonna go check out this old prison. Oh, looks like we got a uh, multiplayer mission right there as well. So we're gonna run up here, see if we can find it. And we'll cut back in once I have a location on this because this island's a little bit large. Well, I didn't have to go very far. As you can see right down there, there's the boat I came in on. And the key data point popped up on my map. Just kind of run up alongside the, the uh, old prison here, Alcatraz. As soon as we ran inside this door, inside the building, a whole bunch of people in here going on some tours, but the key data point popped up on the map. As you can see, it looks like it's up a level over there on the left. Now, these people are all in my way, but we're going to have to try to figure out a way we can get up there. Uh, looks like we come around this way. Where's that key data point? It's up one level. All right, so here's some stairs. Head up these stairs. Looks like we gotta even go up higher and higher. That little arrow on top of the key data point shows you that it is up one more level. So, where exactly is it? Around this way? Uh, I'm not seeing it. I must have missed it on the other side. Let's run back over to this side. that a little oh that's what I missed I don't want the quadcopter I always pick the wrong one I want the jumper so we're gonna pick this jumper up go in this little cutout here and I guess we're going down this way nope we went the wrong way let's jump back up here oh, okay we gotta jump up here circle around and there we go Key data, Alcatraz key data is picked up. That is the final one. There you go, trophy earned researcher, although you guys aren't going to see it because trophies don't pop up when I'm recording the gameplay. You'll just have to take my word for it. But that's going to be it, guys. That is the final key data point that we are searching for on the research tree. Hope you guys did enjoy this series. Again, if you're just watching this video first, I've got a video. Uh, this is part of a six part series, so there are six videos going through all the key data points. If there's any that you're interested in trying to find, need help finding, make sure you find the appropriate video. All the links to the videos will be in the description below. So I hope you guys did enjoy this. Make sure you hit that like button if you, well, if this helped you at all, if you liked watching it, just let me know. 
thanks for watching guys and I'll see you next time.